Last week, 11 News was the first to tell you about the civil lawsuit filed against Claire Harris. She's the woman convicted and sentenced to 20 years in prison for running over and killing her cheating husband. 11 News reporter Amy Tordlani says this lawsuit isn't about money. The plaintiffs say it's about trying to heal some pain. It was July 24, 2002. It was a story that made international news. Clara Harris caught her cheating husband walking out of a Nassau Bay hotel with his mistress. So she ran over David Harris, murdering him. Guilty of murder. Basically, they're seeking is uh, damages for the emotional uh, stress they have suffered because of her actions in murdering their son. They are Gerald Harris and Mildred Harris, the grieving parents who have filed a civil lawsuit against their daughter-in-law. Is there any idea how much they'd like to get from, from this? Money's not the utmost concern. We're going to let a jury decide uh, what amount of money that they should be compensated for their grief. We obtained a copy of the lawsuit. It reads, Clara Harris has settled her children's wrongful death claims, but has refused to accept legal responsibility to the Harrises. We were also given a copy of this DVD produced at the request of the family. It's meant to give the jury a personal look at the son they've lost. Well, we have asked and asked Clara Harris to settle this case. Uh, she settled with her children, uh, but she refuses to, to settle and accept responsibility as to these parents. So as it appears now, uh, we're going to ask a jury to make her accept responsibility. Moments ago, we just got done speaking with Clara Harris's attorney about this civil case and about those allegations that she wasn't willing to settle this out of court. Here's what Dean Bloomrosen told us. Uh, but to simply say that Clara has refused to accept legal responsibility uh, is not quite telling the whole story. Uh, Clara very, very much would like to settle this matter and has tried as hard as she knows how uh, to settle this case. And as a matter of fact, she offered uh, the Harris's her home. 11 News found out that was her lake home that Clara Harris allegedly offered her in-laws. But depending on who you speak with, either that offer wasn't on the table very long or that offer was refused. We're going to hear much more about this in the weeks and months to come. Trial is set for sometime in August. Reporting live, Amy Tortolani, 11 News.